What's up guys, welcome to another unboxing video. I have another accessory for my gaming devices. This is actually the Ugreen 9-in-1 docking station. Let me open this up and see the new accessories that we have. And here we go, I ordered this from Amazon of course, so you can see the packaging. It has 4K, 60Hz, I think that's all I need. And here we go. It's 9-in-1 docking station, Steam Deck and Rogue Ally, but pretty much you can use it for for anything that you want to dock. And there's more information at the back of the packaging. And at the front right here it says 100 watts, um, fast charging, and yeah, really cool. And I'm going to open this up, let's see what it looks like. I've actually been looking for a nice docking station and I found this on Amazon and I think it will work pretty well on what I need to uh, to do and here we go it feels very I haven't opened this up yet but it feels very heavy um, the quality feels nice and here we go it looks like it's made of aluminum. We have micro SD and SD port or reader. Of course we have type C, I mean type A connectors, three type C at the back, HDMI and the LAN. And also have a type A port. And this is why I bought this because of this uh, adjustable stand. This is actually pretty cool and like I said the quality is actually very nice if I think this is aluminum it's pretty much a very very good quality uh, material and we have cable and the manual I don't think I'm gonna need the manual um, this is actually pretty straightforward if you ever use the steam dock before um it's almost the same and here we go this is the type c cable and yeah this is another feature that i actually like it has removable type c cable there you go the cable has a really good quality as well and yep Alright, I'm gonna put everything on the side and I will grab my devices and let's see if this thing gonna fit all my needs. Alright, here we go. First one I'm going to try is my Steam Deck. It's actually, yeah, the quality is very nice. And here we go, my Steam Deck has the D-Brand grip case and it has a stand. I'm gonna test it out without removing the stand first and if it doesn't work, I'm just gonna remove the stand. And here we go. Okay, it fits really well with the stand. Um, you don't if you have the D brand and the stand on, um, you don't have to remove it. And there you go. That is pretty nice. And yeah, you don't have to remove the D brand um, grip. Okay, that is actually very nice. Um, yeah, you can see the stand right here is very bulky, and yep. Yeah, Moving on to the next device that I'm going to test out is my Lenovo Legion Go. This is my new favorite device. This is my travel computer. And yeah, I went to Germany last time and this is all I bring with me. And it's actually very nice. 
um, it fits really well and I have a silicon grip as well um, I don't need to remove it it's just really really good and next one that I have here is my OLED Nintendo Switch alright just gonna remove this cover and it fits really well the only concern I have is the Type-C port it's at the bottom of my uh, Nintendo Switch you can see right there uh, might use it upside down but the exhaust is gonna be blocked you can see right there that is my concern for this one uh, it might accumulate a lot of heat if I put it this way so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna lay it flat let me remove my joy-con here and the the case that I have and I'm just gonna use my I'm just gonna lay it flat there you go Ugreen has a rubberized texture at the you can see the black surface right there is actually rubberized and yeah I'm just gonna use it this way um, because I don't wanna block the the exhaust for my Nintendo switch all right and those are the things that I'm going to test out and this cable is actually very nice I love the quality of it and good thing it's angled and yep I think we're gonna okay it's right there you see the display port you're just gonna put it there and yeah I'm gonna set up my I'm gonna set up everything on my desk and I'm gonna show you what it looks like and here we go inside my gaming room this is my gaming desk um, don't, don't mind the laptop it's it's not connected to anything but the keyboard and the mouse is actually connected to the dock I'm using the Xbox controller here um, I customize it a little bit you can see the time grip is actually time stick is actually removable that is actually a very nice feature um, you can see right there the left thumb stick is actually higher than the right thumb stick that's the way I want it and yep I'm gonna fast forward the video here just to make the video shorter and here we go I'm just gonna play the undisputed and yeah I'm testing out my Ugreen docking station with my Steam Deck and so far so good I don't see any problem and I actually do like the features of this uh, device and here we go I'm just uh, trying to finish uh, a daily challenge if you know this game um, Undisputed you have a daily ch challenge so you have three of them every day and they will restart and I think every week you will change the challenge and it's actually very very cool game one of my favorite game on Steam and yeah I'm just playing I forget the name of this guy I think it's Hamed and I'm fighting Hill and yeah I'm trying to finish this guy quickly and here we go that is a nice knockdown with Ali Shuffle at the end. <laughs> All right, he gets up, and we're gonna see if uh, we can finish him on the next knockdown. Here we go. The game is actually very smooth and here we go another early shuffle that is very very nice thing to do if you knock down someone <laughs> all right
he gets up and see let's see the next knockdown okay all right there you go gonna I'm trying to finish oh okay all right I underestimated him <laughs> I yeah that's what happens if you are very cocky while fighting someone don't do it I ran, ran out of time on the first round let's see the second round that's embarrassing okay And yeah, um, the game looks good using this dock. Um, it's actually very, very similar to the official Steam dock. And but like I said, I think this is gonna be my go-to. This will stay as on my desks now, and I'm just gonna. I don't know. This is my new setup. I'm gonna test out my Lenovo Legion Go and my Nintendo Switch after this and let's see if this is gonna be fits on what I need but so far so good and here we go I set up my Lenovo Legion Go and I'm just gonna I'm just gonna fix this real quick if you can see the side of my screen it's actually hold on let me see I think I need to duplicate this or extend the oh there you go easy fix and it looks very nice I mean it looks like a desktop and I'm using a Ven BenQ um, monitor it's 4k 60 Hertz and I actually love it I love this monitor and yeah I've been using it for I don't know how long now I think two years and I never have problem using this and here we go I just pressed my Lenovo Legion space and I think I'm gonna play Red Dead Redemption and with mouse and keyboard this is gonna be the first time for me playing Red Dead Redemption with mouse and keyboard so bear with me here we go I set up my stuff here but I forgot to turn on the volume and I'm just recording my voice now um, yeah I forget to set up the volume I forget to turn it up it's because my brain just locked in to the game this is my favorite game I've been playing this um, and then stop playing this since I bought it. I actually have it on my PlayStation 5. I have another save game there. Um, yeah, if you haven't seen this game before, or if you haven't played this game before, spoiler alert, this is the part where Arthur Morgan and Charles going to find a new camp for the gang. All right. It the game looks good um, yeah it's actually pretty cool uh, it feels it feels weird that I'm playing mouse and keyboard right now this is the first time I'm, I'm playing Red Dead Redemption with mouse and keyboard I just set up the game or the video times to speed so just to speed things up and yeah um, like I said it, it looks pretty good I never had a problem on um, when I'm recording the video and it function this doc function the way I want it so yeah it will stay on my desk for sure
okay. Come out of that. You okay? Speak their language. You mean as tough and dense as all that? Come on, Luther. And from here, I'm just gonna speed up the the video again. This is times three speed. And yeah, it's gonna be yeah. Um, it feels super weird playing Red Dead on mouse and keyboard, to be honest. And this mission is gonna be uh, a lot of shooting, and we're gonna see how I'm going to perform with mouse and keyboard. It's a little bit uh, tough for me um, playing Red Dead. Uh, maybe if I'm playing Call of Duty, it's easier for me to use mouse and keyboard, but I don't know with the Red Dead Redemption. Alright. Like I said, I'm just gonna repeat it again. The game looks good using this uh, dock. I don't see any problems at all. And I think, I think this is gonna be the best option for any devices that you have. All right. And there you go. When I recording this uh, video, it's actually I'm having a hard time to shoot the, the enemy because of my sensitivity of the, the mouse. You can see right there. <laughs> Keep on uh, turning it. And yeah, I, good thing I have a adjustable sensitivity on the mouse by clicking a button and yeah there you go i've been yeah like i said this is my first time playing red dead redemption 2 with mouse and keyboard i i don't hate it i just need to get used to it and there you go um the duck looks good i don't i don't see any problem at all um like i said this is gonna be my ducking station on my gaming desk and yeah it, it will stay here um i think lenovo and legion uh legion already uh released a new dock but when i search it uh, it's kind of missing some some features and i actually really like the U green better in my opinion i haven't tried the Lenovo Legion Dock, so I can't I can test it or compare it with this um, dock, and I think it's up to 4K 60 Hertz, same as this one, and this one has more um, features. All right, I'm just gonna finish this uh, mission and I'm gonna test out my Nintendo Switch. It's actually a very good game. Like I said, it's highly recommended. If you haven't played Red Dead Redemption 2, go ahead and play it. I, I love this game. I'm, I'm playing it on my PlayStation 5 and placed uh, on my on Steam. And I don't have any issue. Uh, I keep on playing it. I think I spent like a hundred hours already playing this game between uh, two save games. I 
And there's that mission. Um, the guy finally reunited with his family. Yeah, let of Legion go. It's working well with the Ugrin duck. And yeah, it's very nice. Um, like I said, this is gonna be my main docking station on my desk. And I'm gonna test my Nintendo Switch and let's see what it looks like. And here we go, my Nintendo Switch is already set up. I got my Pro Controller. I actually customized my Pro Controller as well. If you can see the time stick, the left time stick is higher than the right time stick. That's the way I want it. And here we go. Um, earlier I said I don't want to put it that way. My Nintendo Switch like upside down. But I'm just gonna test it out for a short period of time. So I don't think the heat will accumulate so bad. So <laughs> I know. Um, yeah. But if I'm playing it long, longer, I'm just gonna remove it and just lay it flat. And here we go, I'm going to test out my Monster Hunter game, this is my favorite game in Nintendo Switch, so yeah, I'm gonna speed up the, the video just to show you guys that this thing works, it actually looks good. Yeah, the game looks very good, I don't, I don't know if you're seeing it using the way, the way I'm seeing it on my, in person, but I can tell that the quality of the the graphics is actually same as the original Nintendo Switch dock. It's actually been a while <laughs> since the last time I played this game and I'm kinda a bit sluggish here. <laughs> okay, let me um, relearn the combo. Okay. Like I said, it's the quality, it's actually very nice. Um, same as the original dock, so I don't think there's gonna be a problem um, using the U green, U green dock for your Nintendo Switch OLED or maybe even the regular regular Nintendo Switch I don't think this is gonna be a problem um, yeah it's pretty nice um, I actually like it like I said it will stay on my desk now um, this is gonna be my uh, new docking station
and there you go. I killed the monster, and <laughs> uh, it took me uh, maybe five minutes. And this is a low rank, by the way. Um, that's why it's very easy to kill. And yeah, um, like I said, the it looks it looks good, and I don't have any problem. Um, after my Nintendo Switch, I'm gonna try to connect my laptop and see what it looks like. And here we go, I connected my laptop and I don't see any problem at all. And it's actually very nice that just one cable, it will uh, it will transfer to my, uh, my laptop. Just turning on my Xbox uh, Game Pass here. But I'm not gonna play any games, I'm just gonna see how smooth this is. And let me see the display settings. Alright, I'm um, using BenQ monitor and it still has a 4K and 60Hz and that's actually very nice. And like I said, it looks good on my screen. Um, I don't have any problem with it. I'm gonna show you how I connected this uh, gaming dock to my computer. And let's see right now. Um, Okay, here we go, um, mouse and keyboard on the side, and at the back we have the Type-C, this is connected to my laptop, there you go, and at the back of my laptop here um, I get my HDMI, and see right here I get my, um, this is for my headset, and yeah, this is the Type-C cable that connected to the, the dock. Alright. And yeah, it's very cool. Um, really easy to move back and forth for my um, gaming console and then my laptop. And I'm going to show you what it looks like with my gaming consoles. Alright, for my gaming consoles, of course the mouse and keyboard on the side. I got the Corsair keyboard. This is the K70. It has two um, cables. The reason why is because of this uh, port at the back. You can see right there. That's where I place my port for my mouse. And that is the Razer Basilisk. And there you go, you have the Type-C and HDMI. I have to transfer it from my laptop every time I'm going to use this dock. So, I mean, I don't, it's not a big deal. And this cord is very high quality. It's really good. Alright guys, um, if you have more questions, let me know. And I will try to answer everything that you ask. And yeah, it's really nice. I love, like I said, I love the quality. The build quality is actually very nice. I think it's made of aluminum, if I'm not mistaken. And the cable is also very good quality. And yeah, this is the first time I'm buying, I'm buying a U Ukraine um, dock. And I'm very impressed about everything. Um, like I said, this is gonna be my docking station from now on. It's gonna stay on my gaming desk. And yeah, if you need to know anything, if I can answer it, I will answer it. And yeah, I'm gonna end the video here, guys. Thank you for watching. And please don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will see you guys later.